click on the activity icon. So between the text and the note, uh, note card, you have an ING activity. Please click on that. ING Clock like a thing. That is this ING. Yeah, that's yeah. I mean, it, yeah. Yeah, double click on that and wait for a second. Okay. So once you click on that, you'll be here we need to define our company. Okay. Go to the new entry. Okay. 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 So what's your company? Last time what uh, what is the company name you have given, Megna? Cubic. Yeah, Cubic. Yeah, let us say you have given cubic, right? Here you can give the more text, means that is a short form, that is a code. So whenever you are defining the company, it can be of five characters, alpha, numeric, right? Okay. The company name can be five characters. And try to give the city. So there are so many fields in this. As we are practicing, mm -hmm. okay, so you can give only the things which are mandatory. So please give the country. For yeah, country please open yes. You are not USA. US. Oh, okay. So if you go down and search. Oh my God, it's, it, it, it's taking Yeah, there are so many. So SAP is present in all these countries, and SAP it's US. It's one second. Okay. Yeah. Now language key. You can work SAP in different languages. Okay. But you English. know, like uh, most of English, E N. No, not there. Please come yeah. down. Yeah. yeah. E N. Okay. You are going in here. Currency. What is the currency? U S D. Mm -hmm. You want to type U S D? Yes, U S D. Okay. Okay. Now try to save. Save this activity. It's very simple, Megna. SAP is very simple to learn. So if you want to master SAP, we need to be like like a child. Don't we should not use our brain as an adult. If we okay. use our brain as an adult, we can't go ahead. We can't like we are at traffic signals, always red signal. Okay. Okay. Now please save this. It's asking for request. What is that? It is asking for? Request. What is that? Right. Yeah. You will come to this. We'll create our own request. Click on the own request. Oh, okay. Own request. So whenever you have a doubt, I'll make a note of that. You can make a note of that. So what this is this? This request. Yeah, please click on this. Select this. Customizing request involving user Megna. Select your. Yeah. So, like when you are creating, uh, let us say that uh, you may be having a different folder for your official documents, and your mm -hmm. you may be having a different folder. In the same way, when you are doing it, all your activities, all your customizing request will mm -hmm. be stored in this request. Customizing request. Have oh, you selected you can that? Oh, you make a folder. Yeah, you, it's a customizing request. So okay. initially we'll go terminology, then I'll explain you the SAP terminologies. Okay. 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 Now try to save this. Click on the green check mark or I did right. Yeah, or else click on the create. We'll use some other name. Create one, yeah. Create request, right? Yeah, create request. Yeah. Here you can give short description. About what? About uh, Megna, SAP HR project. Okay. Okay, try to save this. Okay. Yeah. Mm -hmm. Click on the green check mark. I did train was. Select your Megna SAP HR project once. Because I'm unable to see the screen. Yeah. Yes. Now again green check mark. Yeah. 
So when you are doing SAP, when you are using your server for the first time, it will be asking you the request. Okay. Now it will not ask. So this is how you will be creating the company name. It's very easy to create a company. The company name should be of five characters. You can give alpha or mm -hmm. you can give numerics. Yeah. Yeah. So data has been saved. Okay. Whatever we did, the so-called process like creating company, is it mandatory every time when I am working like as an HR, do I need to create like these companies in this SAP? No, when you are practicing, you need to create. Okay. So in, in, in real time, do I need to do all these things or it, it's not my job? It, this company name and company code is not your job. Okay. Okay. Yeah, but it, it's good to know how to do. Yes, because you know, like I'll give you one example, Meghna. Hmm. Let us say that uh, you are a famous surgeon, heart surgeon. You operate people on heart surgeries, you do. Mm -hmm. Okay. I am not a doctor, but I claim that I have an experience of uh, let us say I'm I'm also a doctor. I mean, so I don't have any experience. I'm not a doctor. But when I go for an interview, mm -hmm. so the person who is in the interview board is not asking anything about anesthesia. So I'm claiming that I'm anesthesia. I have so many years of experience. Mm -hmm. I've prepared all the things, all the important questions. What the panel board is asking, interview board is asking about anesthesia. So I prepared all, like I have gone through all the books, all the journals, all the research papers. I am ready to face an interview of five years of, five years experience of anesthesia. Mm -hmm. But to my surprising, when I go for an interview, they are not asking anything, question, any questions. I just okay. put in the experience that uh, I was involved in so many surgeries, art surgeries mm -hmm. and all the things. Mostly my anesthesia work involves in the art patients. Mm -hmm. So they started asking some basic information about art surgeries. How are, how the art surgeries are from, from what are the art problems. Okay. I was wondering why you are asking all these things, I am an anesthesia. So they told that as you have five years of experience, mm -hmm. you may not be expert, you are expert in your field, but when you are working in a team, you will be able to at least, you should grasp knowledge of 10 to 25 percent in other area, right? Okay, okay, yeah. Since exactly. teamwork, when you are working in SAP, mm -hmm. FI consultant, HR consultant, MM consultants, yeah. all, all will work together. To success, okay. success, uh, you know, patient's operation, we require a cardiologist, mm -hmm. anesthesia, supporting team, mm -hmm. is it not? Okay. Backup yeah, team okay. is required. In the same way, when you claim your experience, you need, you should be, you should be knowing something of everything, mm -hmm. other yeah. modules. You should be an expert of SAP HR, but you mm -hmm. should know some knowledge on different modules, right? Okay. Yeah. Yeah, very true. So there when you go for an interview, they are not asking about anesthesia, they are asking about what other, what, uh, you know, like yeah. a surgeon will be doing, what the supporting team will be doing to genuinely check whether he has participated in the operation or not. Oh, yeah. Did you got my ex yes, uh, example yes, idea? Like why yeah, I me? got it. Yeah. So now try to say this. You have saved it. Kindly go back to the previous screen. Previous screen. This one. This is the one? Yeah, the up. back arrow in a green color box, circle. Oh, yeah, okay. Not that, yeah, this one. Okay. Okay. Are you able to see your company on the first one, Cubic? Yes, yes. Technologies. Now, please select that. If you want to see what you have created, please select that. Um, yeah, you need to click before that, Cubic. Oh, the, here? Yes. Okay. Click on yes. Now go to the detailed icon which is there exactly on the top of it. Here. Here. The second one, cubic, like you know, magnifier kind of a thing is there, right? This one. See where yes. your mouse is. There. See, you know, new entry. Are you able to see the new entry before oh, that? Yeah. Oh, before yeah. that, we've yeah. not new entry. Yes. Details. Yeah. Yeah, details. So SAP is a totally graphical user interface. You mm -hmm. know, like you need to learn more with your vision means visuals. Okay. Okay. Yeah. You know, you have created a company and you are able to see it. See now please go back to the yeah. You are a, you are able to see the details what you have created, right? I yeah. Now please go back to the previous screen. Back again, make now. This one only back here. F3. The same thing, every time the same icon will be used to go back. Okay. 
Yeah, back again, the same icon. So this is how you will be customizing a company. Now we will go to the how to create a company code. So company code should be of four characters, alpha and numeric. So please click on the edit, copy, delete, check company code, IMG activity icon. So IMG I activity icon. Document. Okay, okay, that's fine. I will go to that okay. and I will do it again. So you, have, you No, it's closed. It's okay, no problem. You can open that. Okay. Yeah. Now please click on the edit company code data. Megna, can you please go back to the previous screen? Yeah, please click on the edit company code data. Edit company code data, the second yes. activity. Yeah. Once you click on that, it will be asking for the new entry. Okay. Go to the new entry. I did. Yeah. So the company code should be of four characters. You can give alpha or numeric. Okay. So what was your company? Cubic. Now sh okay. shall we give C123? Okay. Yeah. It, Please give C123. It's, it's like what? Your capital or? Anything, anything you can give. C123. Mm -hmm. Yeah. And again your company name in the next Cubic Technologies. Yeah. Kindly give the city. Currency. Yeah, language, very good. Yeah, now try to save this. Once you click on this, you'll be going to the second screen. Mm -hmm. For company name, you'll be having only one screen. For company code, you'll be having the second screen. Okay. Okay. In the second screen, can you please make it out which is the mandatory field, Meghna? So there are so many fields. You know, in the real time, you need to give each and every field. But when you are doing, when you are learning, there is one field which is must you need to give it mandatory unless and until you give that it will not accept your activity so here yeah. you can see there is a check mark here country yeah. yeah country are you able to see the check mark yes yes I can see that yeah so there please give the country which country US okay yeah, yeah. Uh, and uh, in this screen you will be having a below green check mark Meghna, uh, do you, are you a visualistic or auditory person? Like you learn more with your audio or video, means uh, visuals or kinesthetic? Actually, audio, I can't. Mm -hmm. when, I'm, when I see and when I work on that, yeah. I learn more. Okay, that means you are of, uh, you know, like kinesthetic kind of a person. It's very tough to, you know, teach a person like you. But oh, once you master it, you can be much better than your mentor. Uh -huh, okay. So you need to convince yourself in your subconscious mind. It's not somebody, It's you should feel that yes, you have done your activity, then only you can go ahead, right? No, oh, yeah. Okay. So kindly click on this green check mark. So that means you need to practice every session. Yeah, actually I have a question, but I am not interested you. Whatever we did so far to create a company, whatever okay. everyone you drive you drive me and I clicked on that I created a company mm -hmm. but if you ask me to do it again to create one more company mm -hmm. I don't know maybe I so, remember a little bit so, <laughs> yeah see here you can see some error is there yeah okay so please click on the green check mark okay Yeah, we'll ignore this. Kindly close this activity. Okay. Yes. This one closed, right? Yes. 
Okay. Green check mark. Okay. I'll try to save this and go back. So your company code is C123. Yeah. Meghna, your company code, green check mark. Very good. Now please go back to the initial screen, activity screen, IMG screen. So your company code is C123. Yeah, close this activity window. Very good. Yeah. So you are done with your company name. You know how to create a company name and you know how to create a company code. So company code should be of four characters, alpha and numeric. It can be combination of both. Right, Meghna? Okay. So please go to the human resource activities. If you come down slowly, left, you will be finding a human resource management. Yeah. Please open that. Yeah. So under that we are having four activities. One is personal area, other is personal sub area, one is employee and one more is employee subgroup. Yes. yes. Right? Mm -hmm. Yeah. Megna, the initial things what you have to do is before practicing, as I told if you want to master recipe, please be a child. So try to open all the activities first. Learn the path. Personal area, personal sub area, employee group and employee subgroup. Mm -hmm. Okay? So please click on the personal areas. What Next do you mean by document? the personal? Yeah. No, no, not on the document. Directly go to the IMG activity okay. icon. So we are trying to create personal areas. What are personal areas? Okay. 